Okay, so in a previous video, I uh, demonstrated the use of the Elgato Stream Deck. This is a programmable uh, physical interface that allows you to have multiple buttons for different um, uh, functions in your different programs. So it's primarily made for the streaming community to control the streaming software. And I recently ran into this uh, program here. Let's see if I can launch it. Um, it's called Voice Mod Pro. It has, uh, well, actually, it's called Voice Mod. Uh, I just happen to have the Pro version because I liked it so much. I bought it right away. And uh, basically, it allows you to have uh, the ability to switch voices on command. So uh, I don't know if this is going to necessarily work right now, but uh, uh, let me try this testing one, two. Oh. Okay, testing, testing one, two, one, two, one, two testing, testing one, two. And uh, maybe switch to this Android voice here, so uh, that should sound like something else. Um, maybe switch to this evil voice here. Uh, so basically, it lets you switch uh, your voices on, on the fly. And it has a lot of features in here where uh, you're able to create your own stuff. Um... I don't want to do that. Um, basically, you can create your own voices and things. And I figured this would be a, like a really good uh, application for animators uh, to be able to do like your own custom voiceovers to a certain extent. You know, I don't know uh, the the feasibility for like multiple voices, but I'm sure with tweaking and stuff, you can get a lot of work done without having to um, basically um, uh, rely on. Um, external voice actors and stuff so uh the big thing though that i want to show you guys is its integration with the elgato dream uh, st stream deck and basically you can set up a folder for it and in that folder you can uh basically switch to the different voices or whatever predefined voices you have so testing one two one two testing Testing one two one two, and uh, and, and it, you should be able to just kind of um, I don't know how to turn it off. I think I can do this and basically force it so that the voice only happens when I'm pressing this button. So um, I mean, you can record an entire uh, thing of dialogue all on your own. Um, let's go ahead and try that now. So I'm just going to go ahead and hit record here. Tell me about the rabbits, George. Come on, tell me about the rabbits. Simba, everything the light touches is our kingdom. So let's see what that looks like. And there you go. So um, hopefully that gives you guys some ideas and uh, maybe things to play around with. And uh, uh, if anything, additional options for your cartoon recordings and stuff.